Hey everybody, it's Jacob the Fan123 once you here. Welcome you guys to Pacifist Run of Undertale. Unfortunately, this name already exists, and the only way to change that would be to finish uh, Pacifist or Genocide Run, and I really don't feel like it, so we're stuck with this name. Like I said, that's unfortunate, but there's really not much I can do about it, so... There's Toriel. This is a pacifist run, but I honestly don't care about text or dialogue or anymore. Kinda did most of that anyway. No, not again. I've never actually talked to the dummy. <laughs> I've always either ignored it or killed it. Well, that happened. I guess I have to talk to her. I thought the cutscene would start automatically. I've never actually done a pacifist run myself, I've just watched someone else do one. Although I have spared every character. Although in my new run I didn't actually save Undyne, I just spared her That change in the different colored path is actually quite obnoxious to me, that's why I kept following it. Hello, Froggit. Knowing the 
us might one day leave a toll and get the cheese. It fills me with determination. Hey, it's Napster Blue. Come on, Napster Blue. Oh, right, I'm not supposed to do that. I'm supposed to cheer him. That's right. I remember now. Oh, this attack blew. Ooh, I survived it. I'm not even survived, I didn't even get hurt by it. Maybe I'm better at this game than I thought I was. Oh! And yeah, he's crying himself a hat. I remember that. Basically, you go up to him and say, Hey, I've decided I'm not going to pick on you. Switch. Yay, I spared people. Now, this one is the red switch. Excuse me. 
take the slice of pie. Gonna need that. You know, if she's had this issue, why hasn't she destroyed the entrance to the ruins before? Or the exit to the ruins? Said something like, oh, you look like you've seen a ghost or something. Because this is on a genocide file, so. I have such problems dodging Toriel's attacks. I tried to get myself killed by Toriel so many times. to die. No save even a single child. Silence is how it works. Excuse me. And Flowey is in here. Undertale. Now, if I had been reading all the text and everything, the first episode would probably be over by now. Like I said, this isn't like a... I've shown everything else of this game, including most of the text, so this is really just uh, making sure I show everything sort of thing. I'll show all the text in the ending fight and everything, the main difference, but... Yeah. Whoa. I'm not sure if I saw Sans there, if like you always see Sans there, or if that was because I slightly turned around.
human Wait a second, have you heard it before or something? You turned around before I said to. Whatever, you're a human, right? Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. A ton of work done today. A skeleton. I have it. I hate it. Seems like you're really working yourself down to the bone. of that lamp still fills you with determination. Snow Drake. I have to wait for him to make a joke. And then laugh at it. Ah! And then I can say it. Fishing rod. Well, first off, let's. I don't even need the glove. I'm not gonna be fighting anybody, so I'm not gonna need a weapon until the end. Is that a human? It looks so familiar. Uh, I think it looks familiar because it's a rock. Oh, what's in front of the rock? Oh my god, is that a human? Oh my god, I did it. Undyne will. Did to do. Shall not pass this area. I will stop you. Capture the capital. Oh, that went well. Oh, alright. Hi, enemy. Hi, Ice Cap. Ah. Huh. Oh, I'm supposed to ignore him. Oh, I hate this one. Ah, I have so many issues with that. Okay. Eat one of my monster candies. I've been pet, pet, pat, pot, pet, pot. Oh, he's, he's terrible now. Someone's 
Someone's been smoking dog treats. If you see a move attack, move. Don't move and it won't hurt you. Imagine when you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign is set. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs set in yellow. <coughs> This way, Mr. Snowman. Cool. Tells you exactly how to get to them. Okay, my TV just shut off for a split second there. And it's gone. Great. Got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti fills you with determination. It's an unplugged microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> I'm gonna do. If you, if you can pet him overly to the point where his, his head just like goes all the way off the screen and then comes back and goes off the screen again. I'm just not in the mood. Don't need to do that. I've spent an agonizingly long amount of time before trying to get every inch of snow off of this thing. Not doing that. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. There's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Roll around. Do I have to roll around again? I thought I just had to roll around and then they got my smell. Oh, I have to hit re-smith. Now that I rolled around. Now, I can pet them.
<coughs> now that I've pet both of them once, I think I can uh, expand. Uh, yeah. A new world has opened for us. Now for this puzzle. Well, no, I failed. There is a way to solve this, and I have done it many times before. I just don't remember it right now. Yep, got it. <clears throat> there are other ways to do it, too, that are probably less convoluted, but I, I figured it out. Fucking damn it! Let's do this. This will make it faster. Although you can do that whole thing in reverse and then not have to go all the way around. Hit button. <clears throat> oh, this one. Oh, shit, okay. So, what, was it red tiles or power? Well, you can't walk on them. The other tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you'll have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? No. Hey, I guess I'll repeat myself. Red tiles are impassable. Yellow tiles are electrically dangerous. Blue tiles make you fight a monster. Green tiles are water tiles. Orange tiles are orange scented. If you step on orange, don't step on green. Brown tiles are... Wait, there are no brown tiles. Purple tiles smell like lemons. Why don't the yellow ones smell lemony? Um... Wait, did I mix up green and blue? The blue ones are water ones. Pink tiles... I don't remember! Wait, those ones don't do anything. Okay, do you understand better now? Even less. Okay, you know what? How about you just do this puzzle on your own? I'll leave the instructions, just read them. And when you understand it, you can throw the switch. And do it at your own pace. Good luck! Okay. It's a legible chicken scratch. Machine doesn't even work. I've never actually seen that whole thing where you say you just don't explain it. Oh, lesser dog is here building. Waiting for it to turn into art. If yeah, if you do the whole thing where he stretches his head out to forever, he will actually have built all the art around here and it'll just be tons of snow built up all over the place. Pomeraisins, that's what it is. Wait, what? No, say that again. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog fills you with determination. There we go. Uh, 
a little bird on my head. Hey, look, it's a snow pass. I thought one of the snow pops over here had money in it. I guess not. Yep, yep. Hello. Wakes up, it's so excited. Picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Oh, damn it. I'm pretty sure after it says your movement's slow, your movements do actually slow. You should be sparable now. Hello! I'm gonna use a monster candy. Here's the gauntlet of deadly terror with the dog. Snowden. Buy the man with bandana. And fill up on cinnamon bunnies. Everything, don't care. Alright. Okay, in the next episode, we will keep going over here and continue with the game. See you guys then. Bye bye now.